So, so in this session, I'm going to discuss about how do you call multiple salt queries in single API with parameters and uh, how do we call multiple salt queries on multiple stored procedures in one API. And uh, here, this is the params I am taking. That means I am take I am going to write three salt queries. So which is based on department number, salary, and job. Okay. So this is our API solution and uh, code dot sorry. So router dot post. Multiple select and request response by catch. res dot send new error response 400 and e dot message and here to let body equal to request dot body so i'm taking parameters into the variable of body and let params equal to body dot so what are the parameters i am taking department number salary and job so it is better to go to here and uh, dpt number and the cell I'm giving 3000 and job I'm giving manager so here body dot DPT number body dot cell body dot um, job okay and let call sp equal to um, set p underscore dept number equal to set p underscore sorry at the rate cell um, at the rate p underscore job equal to as here you can write this salt query i mean from self star from employee where uh, dept number equal to at the rate P underscore DPT number. And uh, for our convenience, it is better.
see here i have written the salt queries okay and uh, i am going to get the result so if by calling bbpool.query passing parameters like uh, call sp and params so if any error came then it has to give message like whatever the error came okay and else let response equal to result of actually here if result dot params sorry results result dot length greater than params dot length so here result of params dot length so it is better to put debugging then only we come to know the result and data sets positions so any this method and paste it here see here we are getting some collation errors okay we take this error name and uh, given in given in google see this so here some collation error came so copy this one and paste it after this so where table a dot field after the field name you have to place it place this one so after the field name okay so in, by calling the store procedures you won't get these types of errors okay these types of errors will come for string comparison only okay so and And here observe this result and positions three, four, five. Okay, so EMP DBT data and take this plus one here salary data. to here job data on res dot send emp result dept result dept result dept data and Sal result sal data 
job result job data see so this under this dept result we are having only department number 10 records after that under this salary result we are having only 3000 records under this job result so we are passing manager as a job so all the managers records we are getting okay so this aba is correct so this at this time you don't get any error why because we are not writing the job okay you are not passing job as a parameter i mean we are not using job parameter if we use job parameter then we have to use some collation syntax like this after the column name you have to write this okay so this should be what is the purpose of this one means here this collation is different this one is different so this one makes both are equal 